Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 17 of Let's Play Crash Bandicoot Warped, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Now in case you don't notice, I do have a different headset on, and this one's a little bit cheaper than the one I already had, but the left earpiece on the mic I had died on me, and thus I couldn't really hear much stuff out of that ear at all. It just sounded weird to me. The mic was fine, but it was just a left earpiece, so I got a replacement headset for the time being. I'll probably consider buying a better one, but considering I didn't have much time to get out, this was the best I could do. That being said, let's do orange asphalt. And hopefully these guys can kiss my asphalt. I don't know how this level's gonna go, because I haven't practiced it. Uh, time trial mode. Damn cops. Did I get both boxes? I think I did. That's great. Okay, make sure I avoid the cops. Luckily, I don't have to worry about getting the fastest time. It's just the fastest time in the time trials that I want to get, or at least Sapphire. I'm good with, like, anything around that range. Okay, I'll get off the wheelie now. I think I landed on the box. That's wonderful. Hitting the cop car didn't slow me down. Well, maybe it did just a tiny bit, but not by much. Hopefully I can get this on the first try, and then I can move on to Flaming Passion. Otherwise, I'm going to hate this place for the Flaming Passion. A good steering turns. Beautiful. So far, it's going really well. Made very few gaps. And I jumped over that. I think I could have used that in a big way, but we don't know that. Too early to decide if this is a failed run. Okay, now it feels like a failed run. Damn cops! Why did it take so long for me to go? I think I got this lost. I think it was that one hit to the cop. It was screw me over. And I'm not very proud of that in the slightest. Did I? No, I didn't skip over that. But I think I got very little chance of victory now. Minute 38, 30, 83. Nope, I got nothing. All because of that one hit to the police officer's car that I have to redo this entire thing. Just one mistake. But that one mistake was very costly. I mean, there's no denying that. I mean, all those seconds down the drain because of it. And it really did slow me down, substantially. Almost happened again. Okay, hopefully this will be the last time, otherwise I might have to do it off camera. I did road crash off camera because when I kept doing like practice runs, it kept killing me to try to get the good time. But after a while, I was able to do it. I do apologize for not showing that victory, but... I was just too frustrated, I figured, frig it, I'm just gonna do it on my own time. Again, I'm not proud of it. But at some point, you have to realize enough's enough. That being said, however, I hope that's not the case here, and it just might be. The damn car knocked me off course. Unbelievable. So, let's hope the third time's a charm. Oh, hold on, I might lock out on this one. Like, if I'm failing, it's only by one mistake. And it seems to be the common theme here. Ah, I actually tried to miss that ramp. But this might help. Until you slow down, which I just did. That's it, that's it. This is actually giving me better time. Oh, this is going to be a much better time than last time. Was this just enough? I got a minute 35 on the nose. And that was Sapphire, nice. 
You know, I am going to laugh if to get Sapphire you had to be a minimum of a minute 35. Was it? I don't know. I don't remember. What was the minimum? Minute 36. Jeez, I just cut it real close. Okay, now let's do Flaming Passion. A minute 43. I'd say this one will go well. I really do. Might make a mistake here or there. Or everywhere. Um, is it possible for me to just kill this enemy and then go straight to the time trial? Yes. Okay. I just want to get, like, one little threat out of the way first. Yeah, that's the sad part. I mean, enemies might force you to wait. Uh, uh, oh! Wonderful. Oh my god, I thought I landed on the carpet! Jeez, I can just jump over this guy. Oh, damn. Okay, now I can't make any mistakes. Well, I suppose I could, but why would I want to? I... Okay, I was wondering what happened to the time. I could have swore I could have slowed down a little bit. I was getting a little concerned that I got screwed out of, like, stopping time. I'm actually not too confident about my run here. There's too many things that can slow you down. Like carpets for instance and enemies. Okay, good, good. Could have gotten some extra time from that. Is this the exit? Yes. Oh, that was a very good time. Minute 15. Okay, is this like all the relics for like every area except for like the basement part? I think so. Did I really go through all that? Wow, this is like a ton of progress. Alright, so I did get this one, and I did get that relic. Might as well do an in-game save, because I mean, I did a lot of work. Oh yeah, and I did hot cocoa off camera, because that course I hate it so much. So what's my percentage at now? 94 or 95? Yeah, 94, 27 relics, 25 crystals, it's all crystals. Still missing a few gems. Alright. So, I guess we're gonna go down here. I did get 25 relics, right? So I should have access to this place as well. Rings of power. That one actually has two gems. So let's do Ski Crazed. Hopefully this one won't suck. Just give me, like, narrow lanes, and I'm good. I'm just gonna focus on the box. Oh god, there's a hundred of them. That's just what I needed. Let me just do the normal course first, and then we'll do the time trial. I'm not proud that it's gonna be a hundred boxes. There better be like 20 wooden boxes and 80 nitro ones in the detonator. That'll make me feel so much better. But I don't think this course should be hard. Just don't force me to have to find some forks in the road or forks in the water. Because I will not like that. Checkpoint! Haven't seen any of these in a while. Because I was too busy having to do damn time trials. Uh, that was so close. Okay, I 
I don't want to go that way yet. Just survey the surroundings. Oh, this area looks a bit wide to me. Oh, I think I missed that one. I want to go that way. Yep, there is the box that I missed. Uh, only 20 of them so far. Once I get this one, of course. And now it's 20. So this is gonna be a long course, I betcha. I don't like that. Because the possibility of missing one box is very, very high the more boxes there are. Okay, there are Nitro here. Oh, so close. Getting a bit worried. So yes, I'm pretty sure the detonator is right at the end. And that could really change my fortunes. Oh, it landed right on the bomb. That sucks. There goes my brief period of protection. I'll find my way around that spot later. I wish the lanes were marked a little bit better. You know, just make it like one big line. That would have been much better than, well, this. Uh, I think I have to do that jump twice. That's the only way around it. There's nothing else around here. That looks so unusual. Uh, ugh. to the halfway point in boxes. Good. Okay, maybe this one won't be too bad. I'm just praying that it won't be. Oh, this won't be too bad. Oh, I missed like 19 boxes because there was like one narrow corner that you have to find like in between random buoys. They're not marked. You have to hug the walls to find them. Imagine that. That'd be the game's way of saying, yeah, I hate you. I really don't want to hit the bombs after going this far. Imagine doing a time trial with this! I mean, you have to like... It's like a freaking slalom! Have to slow it down just to hit that box. Oh, 64, nice. Do I have to go back? Yes, I do. No, actually, I don't even know. But I wouldn't be surprised if I do. Yep, I do. Ugh, man, jumped over that box. Ugh, they really want to make me go through that extra effort to get 69 boxes. Oh, missed that nitro detonator. And I missed another question mark box, too. There, that's better. Oh, that's gonna give me only seven more to collect. Some of them are just wedged in here. Two of them, at least. Like four more. Good. Almost there. The sooner I hit that point, the better. Okay, three more. Where are they? Oh, I see one. Ugh. Don't touch the sides. Okay, there's the other two. Okay, got the gem. Now I just gotta do this level again, faster. So help me God, there's too many bombs to worry about. So let's see how the time trials go. Minute 16. This could be scary. Having to do this so fast. I don't know if I can pull it off. But I'm gonna try. Of course, I'm gonna hit this ramp. 
Good thing I didn't waste too much time trying to hit it. I mean, the waves could actually work against you. I mean, you could be going, doing just fine, all of a sudden the wave just sends you into the bomb. If that happens, I mean, that's just gonna kill you in more ways than one. Not just in the game, but emotionally. I think it's better off just to leave that one alone. There we go, just nicked it. Oh, careful. I missed both of them, didn't I? I'm pretty sure... Oh, that lasted long enough. Oh, you had it, you lost it. Easy come, easy go. Oh, go another Aku. I think time trials just give you extra Akus to work with compared to a normal run. Because of all many things going wrong. And you're strapped for time. I mean, what is it, Sapphire? Minute 16? That's stretching it. Oh, there was three, and I only got two. Can I get both? Yes! Oh, man, this is actually going better than I thought! Because there's so much time, and they're all bunched together. Like here, like six seconds, right there in on that one spot. And there's another three seconds, oh my god, look at this! They make it, make you work for it! They give you so much! This is a very generous one. Basically, if you miss it, it's your own damn fault. Like, well, that for instance. I think I still got a very good shot. I'm about to miss it too much. Even then, there's still a very good chance, like right now. Got gold! Awesome! So, obviously, they were very generous in giving you so much time to work with. It seemed like a very long level, but you only get 49 seconds on that time? Roughly? That's very impressive. So, what's left to do here? Obviously, Hang 'em High was already done. Area 51? That's a race. I'm not fond of that. Get your frenzy. And Rings of Power. You know what? Let's try out uh, Area 51. See what that's all about. Why that one has two gems, I have no idea. Cause I mean, it looks like a race. Oh, you gotta be in the dark. Twenty-four boxes. Ugh. You gotta have like, minimal vision. Oh, dear. Maybe first place gets you another gem. Because remember, you can't get crystals anymore. That makes perfect sense now. Now I see what I mean. Kind of wish the boxes would show up a little bit better. I think I should just go for the boxes and then worry about getting first place. If I get both, then I'll get both. If I'm able to be lucky enough to get them both at the same time, I'll be happy. Had to dodge incoming cop cars. Because apparently every lane's the incoming lane now. The cops just don't want to share the road, not even with UFOs. What the hell? Not even gonna respect other races. Even the extraterrestrial ones. Ugh. Look at the UFOs! I mean, they're just going all over the place, not even using turn signals. To them, turn signals is how to communicate with their uh, other people.
pretty sure I'm not missing a single box. I mean, I can't be. It can't be easy to miss a box or two, because, I mean, you get little reaction time compared to what you could in the other racing levels. Even then, you had full vision. Here, you don't. Man, the turning is just so bad. Just the turn is so sudden. Oh, I got them all good. Sure, I didn't get first place, but I'll settle for third. Because I got a gem out of it. I think I'll give this one more try, and then I'll stop the video. This time it's for keeps. No dancing for you, Crash. And time trial is a minute 53. Yay, that's doable. It's very doable, actually. I don't know if you can get a gem for first place and the uh, time trial at the same time. So I might as well just do one of each. So now, don't have to worry about boxes. Pass the UFOs. Hey! Rude! So apparently Murica is in outer space too. Just bug me! That's so rude and disrespectful to people on the road, or bandicoots on the road. Oh, shoot. This is gonna cost me. If I lose first place because of one mistake, I mean, come on, the game is just being too petty. Oh, come on! I let go of the wheelie, and I still couldn't turn the way I wanted to. Oh, this is, this is way too bad. You know what? I gotta redo it. That was just awful. You know what? Let's try the time trial. Maybe I can get the gym and the relic at the same time. Unlikely, but I've been wrong many times before. So let's test that theory out. I'll give it one shot, and then I'll stop the video whether I succeed or fail. Go. Can I get this on the first try? Here's the hoping. Ah! No, don't even think about it. I'm passing you, okay? Live with it. Okay, there's the next UFO I need to pass. Hopefully I can do it. Let go of the wheelie right now. Oh, almost landed right on top of him. That would have been so nice. Okay, I remember one UFO actually bumped me off the road last time. Let's pray that never happens this time. There we go, that was beautiful. She got some extra time for it. Uh, still only in fourth, though. Did that UFO go through the cop car? I just saw it go through the cop car. Like, what the frig? And, and neither vehicle slowed down. That is ridiculous. This game! Third place... There's still hope. Seems a little grim, but it's... Oh, now it's grim. Now it's practically impossible. Oh, and great, now I'm back and forth. I didn't think I'd be bumped back that far. Oh, the turns. I don't even think I'm gonna get Sapphire for this. This game asks for way too much. I 
What am I gonna get for this? Nope, not even the sapphire. Oh, oh well. What was the minimum time again? Let me let me see. I guess we'll find out. So I got a minute fifty six ninety. Oh, I was off by three seconds. So if I didn't go down the chasm, I would have had it. So in the next episode, maybe I'll tr give it another try, and then we'll try out the other levels. I still gotta go to Future Frenzy after all. Goodbye, everyone. Thanks for watching.